afternoon, folks. Big Bo with RVs with Big Bo at Parkway RV Center. Got another travel trailer value from Parkway RV Center. This is a nice multi-room family floor plan travel trailer. So for those of y'all with kids, this thing right here will sleep way more people than you'd ever want to carry with you in a travel trailer or any type of RV. This is a 2016 Heartland North Trail Caliber, very, very high-end camper. This is the model 333 uh, BKSS. And it's a triple slide travel trailer. Uh, the Caliber Edition gives it that extra uh, front cap. Uh, just gives it a little more aerodynamic look. Instead of just a flat cap. Something kind of like that Passport I just filmed earlier. And guys, this is a 16 model for $29.9. It is a Four Seasons camper. I'll show it to you best I can. Um, kind of kind of crammed in here, and I apologize for that. We had a bunch of trailers come in, so we're trying to make do with what we got as far as room-wise. 33 BKSS. Two-inch thick laminated sidewalls. Got the weather guard, of course, Four Seasons. Got the wide tracks axle system, which you can see that puts the wheels further apart so you have less sway. I can't get to it to show you guys, but it does have a rear kitchen on the outside, rear corner, outside kitchen, outdoor kitchen, plus your inside one. Power awning. And go around here. Does have 30 amp electrical service. I'm just plugged into my generator, run the lights and stuff. Six gallon DSI gas electric water heater. Two slides on this side, no delamination. Again, guys, I apologize. <laughs> I can't get to show you the rest, but the rest of it looks as good as what I've showed you already. This is a nice unit, really is, guy. Of course, this was a high-end camper when it was new. Power tongue jack on the front. Um, let's take a look inside. Inside of this thing, there's no smoke or pet odors. Oh, by the way, dry weight is 7927 according to the door. So, of course, you know, having being a triple slide travel trailer, it's gonna be a little heavier than most of them. And it's, you gotta realize this thing's almost 37 feet long too. So it's a, this is a big camper, but when you got a big family, you're gonna appreciate all this room and sleeping capacity. You got a sofa that's gonna fold out, make a bed for two people, a larger table that can sit more and sleep two people very comfortably. Large TV, got the crowned roof. Solid surface countertops. Um, you look over here, your kitchen area. You got a lot of food prep area, which you're gonna need if you've got a bunch of people staying with you. Microwave. I like a little lighting up here. Got a, I don't know what size refrigerator this is, but it is starting to get cold. It's been on the generator long enough to get cold. I'm gonna say, if I can make out the uh, model number, this is gonna be a, this is gonna be a six and a half cubic foot. So, I would have thought they would have put an eight in here because you certainly had the room on top to do it, but It'll work, I guess. <laughs> I don't design them, guys. I just market them. So somebody makes a lot more money than I do decide that was a better idea in a 11 sleeper camper to put a six and a half cubic foot refrigerator instead of a larger one. But hey, it does have the outside refrigerator. So that does help quite a bit. So that's another three or four cubic feet. Walk toward the back. Uh, you got a big closet here in the hallway. Ah. And you've got shelving, which you can remove those. A little dirty because we haven't cleaned it yet. I don't have any cleaning help except for one person. She's just part-time. 
which kind of sucks right now. So if you're local and you want a job, you got one here. Come on down. If you can clean a camper uh, and RVs, we'll, be, we'll hire you on the spot. And uh, you got a fold-up bunk. You've got a couch that makes a double bed for two people. And then across from it, you've got a single bunk, place for a television. That's a big bunk, actually, right there. That's almost big enough for two smaller kids, but we'll just say one. Um, and, of course, your outside kitchen is on the other side of this wall. And this thing's got a lot of space, and we haven't even looked at the main bedroom yet. Uh, bathroom right here on the side. And you got a door to the outside for the bathroom. Got your China RV toilet, sink, shower. A little dirty, but looks good. Not bleached yellow or anything. You just got a 15,000 BTU ducted roof there, and you got a nice size front bedroom too. Which, if you've got this many kids with you, you need. <laughs> Queen Island bed in the front. Mattress looks great. Got some overhead storage. And, uh, oh, okay, this is one of those uh, flip around TVs. I believe, uh, yeah, you can actually flip this television around at night to watch it from the bedroom if you want to. Or put your TV back here, TV up there, and have TV from either direction. Either way you want to go, I guess. Plenty of lighting in here. It's a neat camper, guys. You know, for those of you wanting a big bunkhouse, this is ideal. Heck of a lot cheaper than a new one, let me tell you that. Woo. Half price for what this camper costs new now in a 2022. They do everything a brand new one to do for half price, and we still guarantee you the slide outs, the roof air, with the, both refrigerator freezers, we guarantee. Ah, boy, it's a comfortable couch. Uh, we guarantee the um, water systems, including the water heater. We guarantee all those to work and not leak. Uh, we guarantee, yeah, that's, that's 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 quite a bit for a used travel trailer that we guarantee to work at time of sale again. Guarantee the slide outs, the roof air, the refrigerator, freezer, inside and out. We guarantee the water systems. And uh, that's a roof air. Yeah, roof air. So you get all that at a great price of only $29.9. Financing is available with approved credit and down payment. If you're interested in this North Trail Caliber, give us a call, guys. Our phone number, write it down or, or save it as 706-965-7929 or it's also listed in the video description below. You can call us anytime you want to come look at it. Call us. Make sure it is available for coming down here, of course, for coming long distance. Probably want to consider it leaving a deposit on it. Just a quick reminder, guys, the way we sell we sell all of our units as is, like every other dealer does on used RVs. What makes us different is besides the fact that our prices are lower than everybody else and we charge no fees, is that we still, even though it's an as-is unit, we still go through it. We make sure the slide-outs go in and out correctly. We make sure the air conditioner gets cold. We make sure the refrigerator and freezers get cold. And uh, we make sure the water system works, and the water, including the water heater. So, um, guys, that's a lot for an as-is unit, especially for what we're selling it for. And, of course, everything else is sold as-is. And this is our, our philosophy, guys. We take care of the major stuff. We leave the Mickey Mouse stuff to you. You know, and I mean Mickey Mouse stuff. I mean like any little repairs that any camper or travel trailer or motorhome you buy new or used is going to have. You know, that's just part of, you know, part of buying a used RV. And if you can't fix little Mickey Mouse stuff like a switch or a light or, uh, and I'm just using examples because I haven't really seen anything to point out on this, um, a drawer out of, off a track or, you know, an outlet cover, um, uh, things like that, guys, you, you really don't have no business owning a used RV, <laughs> uh, or have the money to pay somebody to fix it. So that's why I tell people, come inspect the unit for yourself. Let us know you're coming. We'll plug it into 110 power or a bigger generator. And you can turn everything on, including the AC. See what works. See what doesn't. 
before making the decision to buy it or not buy it if you don't feel comfortable doing that spend you a few hundred dollars and, and hire you an inspector guys the, these third-party inspectors man that's the berries i mean i wish he, we had them years ago i mean it basically takes the guesswork out of buying a used rv you know what's good and what's bad from the get-go of course guys the only things we fix are those systems that i mentioned everything else if it works it works if it doesn't it doesn't it's up to you to buy it or not buy it or fix it or not fix it after you buy it it's as is but we like i said we guarantee the those major systems to work and we fix them if they don't before you pick it up that's as fair as we can be and keep our prices down as low as we do and that's the thing guys you go to any other any new rv dealer that has used inventory or whatever it's as is they they don't even clean them they don't do anything to them no guarantees no inspection and they want thousands more for them plus fees that we don't charge there's no dock fees here no prep fees no freight fees no happy camper fees whatever uh fees they come up with guys are all 100 percent dealer profit our prices are 29.9 plus applicable sales tax that's it easy simple and done haggle free firm uh, we've been doing this 54 years and we keep things easy simple and done like i said that that right there says a lot you're not going to get hit up with up sales you're not going to have to worry about us making money on financing we don't mark interest rates up on financing like other dealers do costing you thousands of dollars on top of the higher price on the financing guys that's the thing we save you money on the price the financing and we don't charge you any upsells upsells are like the extended warranties the gap insurance the uh interior and exterior protection packages the roadside assistance which you should have through your auto insurance uh i'm talking um tire and wheel packages all that stuff's not worth the paper it's written on always say no to them dealers have got everybody brainwashed into thinking they have to buy that stuff the reason they're so strong on that is because hey it's a, they got it marked up four times dealer cost just because they sell a product don't mean it's a good product just because it has a word warranty in it don't mean it's the kind of warranty you think it is <laughs> so that doesn't mean it's going to repair everything at no cost no guys these aftermarket warranties will find reasons to not pay it then they will to pay it and that's, that's how they make their money if they actually paid claims out on every little thing that broke on it they wouldn't make any money so uh they're going to do everything they can and very rarely do they actually pay a claim and more often than not they only pay partial payment so it's just a waste of money i mean you put that money up that the warranty costs you put it in a savings account uh and just draw on it when you have repairs and here's the thing guys about the warranties they don't tell you about many places independent shops many dealers don't take certain warranties because they make them jump through hoops you're limited on where you can take it to for a warranty claim to begin with and uh the good thing about doing what i said you should do take that money put it in a savings account every play everybody takes cash <laughs> any repair you're not limited on taking it to this certain kind of dealer or that certain kind of dealer you can take an independent shop you can pay a mobile repair man or person excuse me it's 2022 mobile rv tech uh you, you know you, you can take it anywhere you want to because you're paying it out of pocket you're not limiting yourself to a certain uh dealer or network of dealers etc and you know here's the thing i'll tell you a little inside secret about warranties you know warranties pay a reduced labor rate uh to the dealer service department so you know what happens when it's got a warranty it's put on the back burner months months and months in some cases and yeah some of it's waiting on parts and warranty authorization i'll give it that but half that time is because they're just taking care of the cash repair customers first because they're the ones paying cash instead and paying the full labor rate versus the warranty customers who are paying a reduced rate so they're putting them on the back burner until they run out of cash customers to repair so you're always going to get it repaired faster as a cash uh, service customer than one with a warranty no matter what warranty you buy so anyway, just a little inside secret about aftermarket warranties. Factory warranties are good, but then again, new new RVs have a ton of factory defects. So, you know, you're, it's going to spend a lot of time at the dealer service yard getting repaired or waiting on getting repaired. So you have to keep that in mind. First year you own it, it might be in the service yard two or three months for repairs. 
but you're paying on it. But anyway, guys, um, nice unit. Give us a call if you're interested. 706-965-7929. Call before coming to look. Hit that subscribe button. Smash me a thumbs up if you enjoyed the video. Comment, share on social media. I uh, don't know if I get another one on today or not, but at least this one to give you a couple to do today, or actually three. Um, and I'll have some more travel trailers, fifth wheels, motorhomes coming up uh, soon. I'll try to do one or two tomorrow, if depending on traffic and weather. And uh, thanks again for watching, guys. Feel free to comment, share, subscribe. Uh, if you're on Facebook, like my Facebook page, RVs with Big Bo. And look forward to seeing you here in beautiful Ringgold, Georgia. Thank <laughs> you.